I'm saying what kind of deal is today I don't know what to say at this point do I even know how to film these videos anymore at this point do I even know how to film a video anymore like it's gotten to that stage where I haven't uploaded so sorry so sorry I've been slacking recently um yeah so I've, I've been in a rock haven't been motivated haven't been story of my life right now is I'm just not with it I'm not with it right now you know I'm not in my summer girl era I'm not in my motivated era yeah guys so I'm trying to get back on track I'm trying to make July a good month for me because yeah I've been not doing my best and I know I can do better so I'm gonna try and be consistent there's a lot more to come I have fun things coming in the Taylor Swift which I haven't got tickets for you know, you you just have to say that you're fine. <laughs> that's a story for another day because ugh, I'm so upset but this is me trying to lift my mood not bring it down so I'm excited for the summer I turned pretty season two can't wait for that speak now Taylor version <laughs> I'm so excited for it and what else am I excited for Barbie you know, I'm wearing pink today to represent. Yeah, I'm excited for loads of things. My cousin is coming from Finland as well to come and visit us in London. I'm so, so excited to show her around. So I want to vlog that as well, that journey and take you guys along with us. In today's video, I actually went to B&M yesterday and I forgot to show you what I got in the haul. So I thought I'd just do that now um, while I'm filming. I'm filming other things as well in between. So keep an eye out for more videos, guys. I promise it's coming. I went to Home Bargains. Did I say Home Bargains? Before I meant Home Bargains. Home Bargains for the first time ever. I've never been. There was a store that I saw and I was like, you know what? I'm going to go in there and see what they've got. I wanted to show you guys what I've got. I've got loads of stuff. Bearing in mind, I live in a, in a flat so I don't have a garden. I didn't even look at the outdoor stuff. In today's video, I wanted to show you guys what I got. So let's start it off. It's, it's, it's just a couple of things to be honest. The thing is, this is where it's trouble. I went in there being like, oh... Let me just see what I can find. Maybe I'll try as a flora here and there. Like maybe I'll just what I'll find. Like it's I don't need anything. Like basically, I don't need any home stuff. I, I'm not really looking for anything, right? Tell me why I literally bought nonsense, nonsense, and it came up to like 45 pounds. I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my god. So some of the stuff I already ate because it was food. <laughs> so I got these sweets. They were like 2.99 or 3.99. It was like a big box. It was so good. I shared it with my family. And um, I also got these crisps. They were chili crisps and they were so delicious. I'm gonna go back and get them again. One of the big things that I wanted for summer was a picnic blanket. I just thought this picnic blanket was perfect because of the size of it. And it was like, I think it was so cheap as well, like if I remember correctly. But if I wanted something like this in Sainsbury's, it would cost me so much more. This is a 170 by 170 centimeter deluxe picnic blanket, it said. But. So this is the pattern that I got and it is huge I don't I can't even show you in reference like it is humongous just just know that it's it's bigger than your average size okay the next item did I need it no did I see it and think mm, that could actually be good in organizing my wardrobe and I just was like let me just try it I don't know what I'm gonna do with it but it's this thing um, it is called a hanging wardrobe organizer I don't know maybe I'll put some shoes on there or I don't know like I really don't know what I'm gonna put on this if you have any suggestions let me know I don't know what to put on there but I'm sure I'll make use of it somehow next up we have a mobile holder like a thing that I could just film my tiktoks on I just thought it would be handy like hands-free recording so I just got that and it was only like I should look at the receipt where did I put the receipt I don't know where I put the receipt guys it wasn't that much it was like 2 99 3 o'clock 3 o'clock <laughs> three pounds maximum like it was not that much. I, I, that's why i picked it up because it was a bargain and i was like oh that's so cheap and for my little cousins i have cousins that are like children so so got a few things that we could take to the park and just like for summer days i've got these yo-yo i think this was only like 99p if i remember correctly and just a couple of water balloons i thought this would, could be fun um and they were really inexpensive they were really good for value for money this is also another thing that i was like whoa i didn't know i needed this but i want it you know this is an electric clean brush set it's so cool because it has all these different heads as you can see and um, I'm really intrigued to try it out I think it was only like 5 dollars it says high-speed cleaning I can't wait to try this out and see if it's actually good so yeah I'll keep you updated on that one I've got a couple of these for the toilet it's stuff that I don't even really need but there were like I think it was like six 
for 40p or something and like Poundland sells two for like a pound so I was like you know it makes sense it added up in my head I was like let me just pick it up I got this which I thought was really cool it is a Zaflora I love Zaflora I literally use Zaflora all the time when I'm cleaning this is a scent crystals so it eliminates odor room filling up to four hours of fragrance so this you actually put on top of your burner like you know the the little thing with the tea light candle in at the bottom and then like you put this at the top and it's basically like crystals it smells amazing i haven't tried it yet i'm excited to give this a go i also got a couple of these scent satchels so i've heard a lot of people talking about this i've never actually tried these scent satchels i just prefer lighting a candle or using a spray but um yeah i'm intrigued to leave this around and see if it actually smells nice it says long lasting up to four weeks fragrance so the flora as well. I actually saw loads of different the flora things as well. There was like this different scent that I've never actually seen before anywhere else. So that was really cool. I watched some hauls on YouTube as well. And I saw a lot of people picking like these ones up. Um, so they are really, really pretty as well. I think they were a little bit more expensive. Fresh linen, comfort. I love linen scents. Like I think linen scents are my favourite scent. I will love a linen scent. It never lets me down. You know like sometimes sweet scents can really let you down. But linen scents never lets me down. Like, so I want to try this out as well. I also got these bubble things for the kids. I think they were only like, guys, I can't find my receipt. I think it was two pounds. Like it was not that much or one pound or something like that. Oh, these are the sweets. Some of the sweets that I didn't try yet. This is the toxic waste. I just remember my childhood when I see stuff like this. And it was only like pennies. So I had to pick it up. This is literally just unwanted things that I just thought, oh, that could be good. Like, oh, I need that. Like, oh, maybe I do need that. You know, like it was just random things. So I got this lime scale remover for our kettle and um yeah just little things that you could just chuck in the cupboard you never know when you're gonna need it so got that one i also wanted to try this a bath soap it smelled really really nice in the store so mm, like marshmallows like it smells sweet like very sweet and i like the packaging as well it's so cute so i love a good bath and i really wanted to try that speaking about baths i also got some muscle soap this was very cheap i think like it's a good size as well it's not too too big like, i hate the big big ones oh yeah i did get a couple of pet stuff for my cat as well um she's already played with it so it's already been opened but i did get a couple of things um for her like this one thing with the feather on it and like a couple of um like little uh, squishy animals so that was really nice and they actually do cat litter as well there i didn't know and um cat food so it's definitely a place that I'm going to be checking out when I am in need of those supplies for Rosie. They also had like the got to be spray for 3 dollars Like they had so many bargain things there. I use the got to be glue. I actually need one soon. So I was like, oh, I'll get it from here because in, in Superdrug and, and Boots and all of them, I think it's definitely more than 3 dollars if I'm correct. So Flora also had, which I, I was very surprised about, they had loads of candles. They had different scented candles and diffusers as well. They had a whole thing of things that smell nice. Like it was, I was like, wow, Zaflora, you're actually doing more than just antibacterial, you know, wipes and all of this. So yeah, the store that I went to was huge. Like there was so much more that I wanted to get, but obviously I couldn't lift it all. So I was like, I can't carry this all. So I'm happy with the stuff that I got. Thank you so much for watching and there will be more videos to come. I promise you guys, just stick with me. <laughs> Take care.